Hello and welcome everyone, Laha here with part 42 of the Rise of the Republic Rome campaign for Total War Rome 2. We continue where we left things off last time. Thank you once again for your comments, advice, tactics and suggestions. They're all greatly appreciated. Do keep them coming. So picking things up where we left them last time, we're pretty much at the start of a new turn. I'd uh, just set the army up at Patavium to recruit some more units before I forgot. Loads of you have been saying, why don't I try and upgrade as many of my settlements up here as possible so that I'll have uh, as good of garrison as possible uh, when we do turn on all of our current allies in the north. Um, so yeah, let's throw some, throw some things in. I don't know if we'll get around to declaring war on the Umbri, the uh, Etruscan League, and uh, the Vasil this episode, but at the very least we'll get to a stage where we can do that at the start of next episode. So it's just hopefully blasting through a few turns to get ourselves ready for the, uh, the great and final war that is to come. Um, let's go for that and that. Upgrade that. What does that do? That does mining from industry. Cool. Upgrade that in there. Yeah, we can, we can set a fair few of these bits to make sure they're strong. Patavium is upgrading. The other territory we have in the north is over here, so let's make sure each of these have their upgrade. So that's five turns that we need to technically wait for. Which isn't ideal, but we can make it work, I guess. We can blast through loads. I don't think we're, gonna we're not going to have any battles till then, so might as well. There are these guys over here. So once this army's built in two turns time, we might go and take out the Illyrian raiders. Um, eight and your minus two. That's fine. Actually, I should check with all the territory I've just taken uh, as this shifted political party affili uh, affiliation, rather. No, it's definitely going to change when we go up through here, so we will need to, take, uh, to keep an eye on it as we expand. We can actually see from the map that there are a couple of... Uh, Democratic Confederation forces still floating on round. So let's go have a little looky. So there's these guys over here. They're obviously now attritioning because they don't have any territory left. So the chief over here. Little navy down there. Full general there and a full general there. I'm good thinking I built up another army down at Carthage. Um, so that we could... Um, get some elephants recruited and a full army of them. I was thinking, who... I mean... Yeah, we could go for... Lysinia. They're pretty loyal to us. All the others have got generals out. Oh, yeah, and Lysinia's got a chap available that I was obviously building up, so let's go for him. Is that you, though, or was that you? Let me check his name. It is Gellius. That's it, Gellius. Reinstate legacy. No, that's for navy. That upset anyone anywhere? It doesn't improve relations, does it at all? Armor for units. But no, we want public order authority. Authority when leading an army. Lots of wounding enemy agent. Yeah, go for that. And you can be promoted as well. You can be... Seek spouse. I could marry you off with some of these. That does give... Uh, oh, we can't do a political marriage, can we? Is that one of the options? I forget. Oh, political marriage. There we go. I could do that over there, but she is 56, and how old is he? Because I was going to do this to uh, Fabia, but we're never going to get there. Oh, he's he's 50. She's 73. Damn, she's still going. 58. Crazy eyes. <laughs> um, he's House of Furia, though, isn't he? Can't do a marriage. Political marriage, no valid target. So is he, he's just part. He's part of my family, right? They're just other nobles within it. Guess we should seek a spouse for him, really, shouldn't we? A 
drunken wife. Damn. Oh, we get to see her. Yeah, he is a prolific husband, though. Plus 30 to having children. He's, he's pretty good, old crazy eyes. I'm afraid you as well, promote you. You're a leader of uh, an admiral. You're, you're not a leader of admiral. You're a leader of a navy. You're an admiral. Uh, send gift. Plus two target party. Why? Their loyalty's too low, so it's a minus four. Why? Because level just diplomat. Okay, so yeah, he's going to get upset soon, so we'll have to just out. I'm kind of hoping he'll die soon, actually. Um... Marry off some of these ones, but eh. Um, I might just go through and up upgrade them all. Loyalty, political party, upkeep. Oh, can we do? Can we do that? We can just do that to improve his loyalty. Let's just do that then. God, it costs a lot of money though, doesn't it? Oh yeah, but we'll just do that to him though. That's fine. That sorts some things out. Um, we can also do that here. God, it costs a lot. Probably should do it though. I can't see a downside right now. Oh no, that upset you guys. Because, yeah, we're more influential now. Damn it. Okay, well, I can't do that to everyone, but we've done it to Lucius Furious Aquila, so the air is upgraded. We need to boost him next turn. It's fine. We'll make him strong. Um, Servius Macella. Yeah, we've we haven't got given you an army yet, have we? Oh no, he here's a general. Good. Armor for all chance of having children. Uh go on then, but we'll require you to have a wife. How is she? She is a beautiful wife. Lovely. And click on her. What sort of husband is he? He's a religious husband. Cultural influence. Lovely. And Yeah, go for that. And influential woman. Good. Right, anyway, let's probably not have enough money to build anything here. Elephants. Ensis <laughs> um, Prince Pace, chuck them in there. Spent all the rest of our money. But at least... They're on two now. They're on 11. Yeah, we have... We ha oh dear, we have dropped it down a bit, haven't we? Because of all the upgrades and stuff we've been doing. Character levelling. We're still positive, it's fine. Let's sort you out next turn. Um, we have our archers that we're moving over here. Hello, poppets. You guys are recruiting like crazy. You want to get archers like crazy. That's what. Oh, no, we can. We can upgrade more than one. That's it. Fleets are you ready. I might make another fleet with the money that we have. I've just realized we haven't built anything over here. Might have slums next turn, but there's nothing else I can do. That unless I cancel some stuff now, we'll just leave it. Uh, you need one more unit. I think you lost a unit of Vensis Prince Pays, or did we lose some cavalry? One or the other. We're probably going to face some slums, but I'm just going to have to deal with it. Right, end the turn. Let's crack on Lionheart. Come on. Got to at least get ready to the point where 43 can be the, the war to end all wars. If we can't reach it by this episode, I'm going to give myself five turns so that those buildings in the north are upgraded, just to give a little bit of extra garrison there, and then I think we need to uh, strike. They're all attritioning, so wherever they land, the garrison should be able to deal with them. I'm hoping the garrisons will... Uh... Oh dear. Public order all provinces. Only four turns, though. But yeah, I'm hoping the garrisons will be able to just order resolve them, if anything. No slums, as far as I can tell, so that's good. So, let's get all these things in here. Yes, let's get a field of Mars here. Because I want to possibly pop another unit in there. That's good. Right, that's uh, a lot of money spent over there. Got anything else we need to upgrade? Not desperately. Wouldn't mind upgrading that, but let's get this army going. Do lots of African elephants. How can anyone refuse Rome's call? 
We could just ferry some elephants up there, though, but I... I think we'll just go with two for now. Could always bring more up, but eh. By the time we get them up there anyway, now we'll just we'll just leave things as they are. We could go for just for more elephants in this army. Let's go for four. We can always swap them around with other units elsewhere. One, two, three, four, five, six. That way we could give another army some elephants, I guess. Rather than yeah, okay. Six of Enter Prince Bays. One, two, three, four Triarii. Um, yes, we'll have a ballista. I want archers, really. Um, we can get Sardi archers from up there, can't we? So that'll leave room for four archers. Uh, lovely. Plus, I'll take another... No, I'll take some cavalry from someone. He goes over there. I can't see what precisely you've got. Have that. Where are missile troops? How far did I move you? All the way over here. Upgrade. Normal stance it. We serve without question. Upgrade all of you guys. Upgrade all of you guys. Right. Come on. Four. Advance. There you go. Right. Then we've got three armies across here. We've already got one ready at Rayti. I don't think we need more than that here. So, you, what house are you? You're part of Lysinia, I think. So, we'll disband you for now. Speaking of factions, let's take a look at them. Dropping down a bit because we need more military actions, don't we? I'm gonna level you up, but I can't afford to do that. God, she's got a lot of gravitas, just realised. 73. It's just through her being an influential woman. Um, House of Claudia, you can have... Everyone has the free upgrade. You can have it, at least. You're not... Sp I've just taken you out, haven't I? Yeah. We must have lost their faction leader recently. 2 minus 6. I have to secure their loyalty. I think it's only, it's only going to take till next turn. That's nearly ready. That army is fully ready. So you guys can move up ready to strike Takuna. But I actually I would quite like to use my navy to go in and, and take that one. So we'll just breeze on past. The other army can move up towards uh, Vei. And you guys will push up here. Are you guys worth saying I should get rid... I should cancel all the military access? I mean, I don't care about... We're going to be disloyal when we do this. But I should cancel the military access... You have reached civilized lands now. I but they can't go through my lands. So let's do that. We must find an alternative route around your lands. It will come up. How irritating. Well, it's not going to tell me how many turns. It's just going to tell me that that is going to happen. Okay, let's cancel the treaties. Broken treaties upset them. Twenty-five. We are, as always, a welcoming. The mighty legions will no longer march across your land. Good. Probably, you have made they'll probably the start me. I will make the effort. to work out what's Other going on. We are still military allies, as well, I'm sure. this way it kicks out their armies from my land so they can't just sneak on around and attack me. They will face them in their territory. Plus it kicks them all back to their own territory so they've probably got a better chance of uh, building up interesting forces to face off against me. That's going to take five turns to do. I don't mind... That won't be quite ready. The main ones to make sure that they were upgraded at least to this next level are these here. So four turns left. And then we declare war. Um, I probably should check all of these. It's going to take five turns. That's fine. We'll, we'll be pushing up very quickly. So we'll catch up to these. Pretty swiftly. This is going to be... Hmm... This could be an interesting one. I, what I might have to do here is actually move on in and set up an ambush. Oh, something's happening in the background. What's going on on my desktop? I'm going to move you guys here though and go into ambush. Might draw these guys in. So we'll let them move because they'll either move over to 
uh, Nursia so I can then take uh, Spoletium. Keep on moving on up. Can't take on 13. Well, maybe we can. What, what sort of troops do they have? Garrison, so they've got Italian swordsmen, veteran spears. <laughs> Probably, I would like to think not, but I don't know. You guys can weigh in on that. Do you want to? Do you want to see me fight it against thirty-one or not? Um, good here. We built everything we need over here. Mercenaries, can we pop any mercenaries? I could throw in one of these necrotic runners because they're the ones basically like mace hands, aren't they? They've got like a in their gauntlets. Let's throw one of them in there until I can recruit something else. I'll try them out in battle. We are ready to do battle. I just need to sit here and replenish. I was going to do you and take how many turns? Two. That's fine. All of you guys are oh, not all of you can upgrade. Rip. That's it. We await orders. You get get you guys here. I'll probably sell up with each of my three armies ready to strike these guys straight away. Declaration of war there is. There are these guys on there. General, we'll see where they go. We'll take Corsica very swiftly. Come on, send yourselves to your oblivion and bis. Veteran increases in rank. Good, good. Politician returned home. Positive size slavery is what we're now researching. Yep. More wealth. Good. Jewels from Massalia. Plus 20% wealth from maritime commerce. All regions are lovely. Oh, you guys are very, very upset. Is that because political actions? Well, because I've been boosting people. We can. It's because we need to do two lots of these. And because you guys are pissed about uh, tr tax levels. It's fine. I'll soothe you both. There we go. And if we boost you with this, a lot of money, but. The rest of them won't like it, but we them dealt with for a little bit. That's fine. Uh, what other notifications did we have? Quartermaster report. This point loyalty. All the political party the catch belongs to. Oh, good. Nice. That is good. Oh, yeah, you guys are going to stay there. This army's all good to go. Oh, cavalry can be upgraded. You guys are going to sit in Vei. So we now obviously lose um, vision. Speed and discipline, men. Speed and discipline. Vei lands. That's okay. The navy can get itself ready. I was hoping to get another one actually. You have I, I think I've already had you recruited, but let's see how you are here. Oh no, that's fine. Send the ships out at course for port. I'm gonna get another navy going here, I think. How what was the build I went for here? Triarii and then four missile yeah. Boom. They're ready in five turns, so they won't be ready to go straight away. That's fine. They can help out towards the end. This army is now good, so in fact we can go after these guys. Finally, actually can challenge them. We need to make sure we get back, though, in three turns, ready to declare war. I think we will do that at the end of the episode. That's fine. You guys are just going to flee away if I move on you, so we'll just wait. Everybody upgrade. 
Are you guys all replenished? You are. So into the water time. Send you up this way. It will go for the provincial capital, and then this army will go straight in for Phallus. Quick strike, and then we'll have three armies in Corsica that can then sort of land and bombard and cut into the Etruscan League territories further north. We need to get you guys going. One more turn, then we can start sailing out with you, although we've got to wiggle past these guys. Um, beyond ships, but yeah, that's, that's fine. Throw that in there. Good. Good, good, good. Oh, no, we can uh, assign a upgrade for the veteran. Of course, there you go. Unfortunately, we can't get any more, otherwise I would put them into my other armies. Conflict of the Orders. Uh, a group of Greek craftsmen offer to renovate several buildings. They would be more efficient and cheaper than the local builders, but the locals have already indicated, uh, or rather it's not already indicated, already incited the other plebs to rise up and protest against the foreigners. It's evident that we need to act. The question is how. Wait it out. Make them work together. They will learn much from one another. Try to drive the Greeks away. Gather even more Greeks. Make them work together, I think, is the best way to do it. Right, uh, what have we got? Motivated populace. Construction reports. Lots. <laughs> All the construction. Alright, let's take a look at politics. Minus two, two, four. First time these guys have been positive for a while. Um, it's fine though. Vei isn't, I mean, isn't fully upgraded, but... Two, right, man. Guys are all good to go. Um, may not be able to run away from me or run far enough away from me now. Let's see. No, you can still run. Still attritioning though. There's, there's no way you can go. The get my garrison's gonna wreck them wherever they go now. Uh, actually, no. Just make that one the civil port instead. You guys are gonna go around here. You're going up to Mantinion. You guys are going here. Take this course. You will take this course. Uh, spy, across please. Over here, in fact. And they started pulling back. Still can't see their troops. Can't reach them. Uh, screw it. We're gonna we're gonna go for it. I don't think they can get us. towards Corallis. It's where they're all sort of lying around. Good, good, good. Uh, what don't we have here? We don't have one of those buildings. Great, these settlements are long. They're still sitting in my territory even though I've cancelled military access. Fine. Right, we can get up there pretty easily. Got to catch up with them, then we need to get them back over here. Pronto. Rome is nearly ready. If you are wise, you will... No, no military access. You will die.
Conflict of orders, shut down the law of a young patrician from the Senate is, has insulted the plebs and now they openly demand that he be stripped of authority. What should we do? First crowd, it's only scold the patrician. Enemy of the people to mm, wait it out. Mm, if I do that, it's probably going to upset them. Both of those are going to be upsetting. We limit. Yeah, let's go for that, but who knows? We're going to find out the conflict of order resolution soon, aren't we? This will be fun. They haven't brought an army into Tokuna yet. Yeah, we're just going to go in with all the tree REI, land it, and strike. They've got heavy hoplites, four of them, four Etruscan city guard, Etruscan archers. Do have this army if it if it looks really bad we can always bring them in as well but i'd rather not have to do that we can help it so there should only be one turn left on all of those so we can uh attack you guys can't get away so it's the end of you guys we are fighting on the sea though so we might lose units here Be replenished in one or two turns time. Okay, we might wait one more turn then until they're completely ready, but we'll see. The Roman army is up oh, do your feet hurt? Tough. Just trying to think in the north, where should I strike first? I know they've got an army over here, so maybe I should go for where I know they are rather than worrying about where they aren't. In fact, oh, I was just thinking we could take out the Umbri. Well, we could force them back to Vercellum if we march on the provincial capital up here. Ridentum. Oh, they've also got Bergamon. Oh, it's part it's multiple regions. We could push through there then. That's fine. The Vasil can be very easy to take out. In fact, I'd almost be tempted. Could go after them first. Maybe I should go after them and then we march north. That'll reduce these guys. Let us strike first. Hmm. Interesting thing to ponder. We are nearely in position here. Good. We'll be able to strike next turn. And you guys are in range as well. My spy is not going to be quite ready to go, but that's okay. You guys are coming in here, but you are pretty weakened. There's 20 stack versus 9 and 4. I'll have you. You guys, we can try and play catch up to bring these elephants in before the end of the war. But we'll see. We could just wait more turns, but I don't think there's no no real point delaying any further than we need to. Carthage. God, just the amount of income is brilliant. Spine is actually doing really well, all things considered. Rated that we can get this positive side of slavery in there next, so that's going to be five more turns. So that's on. So we might get a chance to do that before the end of the, uh, the let's play. Five turns, I think. Yeah, I think it'll take about five, five or six turns to get through all that territory. Um, we don't need a that there. We might as well make you all commercial ports. Right. Potentially, we declare war when we get back to our turn, or we might wait one more I have not just for replenishment. But we'll see how that northern army does. I kind, I kind of don't mind if the north is under pressure. That's fine. It's always been our weakest. Um, weakest force. Ah, of course they would come back here, which means I am gonna have to. Probably bring you guys back to deal with them. So I mean the tribesmen, the medium spearmen aren't, but realistically make sure we reclaim these. Okay. The Masili are here. Yeah, turn them back. Those are here. Let me just check these guys. How are they looking? They do need another turn before they're fully replenished. Will they still get a turn if I pull them here? They then, oh, so I need a turn. And they can strike 
the only Sar Sarcinia, the Sarcina, the only territory these guys have. We'll wait one more turn then and then declare war. Oh, exciting. Uh, we can set these up to upgrade again. Our breadbasket region up here anyway, so cool thing. In fact, where does that come on the earnings? There, it's in, it's in the top 10. Oh, you don't need that temple there. Um, yeah, that's fine. Um, could change it over to agricultural income, but I'd rather just build up some more agricultural income anyway. Politics. Two and minus two, that's fine. You've got to be happy. I can always drop the tax level down if we wanted to make those guys much happier. But we don't at the moment. We just want all the monies. How is our fleet doing? Things are about to and declare war next turn. It will be one turn off finishing. That's fine. Right, end it. No, we've got one more thing to do, which is our spy. And I'm going for that, although I've never bothered actually using it. Sabotage supplies, which just reduces their movement. Well, it would be good at keeping them where they are. Um, we just may have to reclaim a fair few of our northern regions. Obviously, it's just very random generals in there with mercenaries, but I think that's too easy. We'll take what little challenge that there will be offered. So let's take you guys out of forced sail. march. Have you sitting here. You can set sail on your word. Heading out to sea. My spy still go? Yep, skin. it can. Good, good, good. Let's go there. Right, end the turn. I've just realized I've got a spy there as well, actually. Oopsie. We shall declare war. Ah, you guys are coming in to attack. Oh, look at all your elephants broken. Oh, they're going to be reinforced by the Masili. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, it's a good thing we're coming back then. Um, I get we are going to kill more of them if we fight this. But we've got some pretty good elephants on the way. Nah, you know what? We'll all resolve it. Got so many. Well, we could definitely clear these guys out, couldn't we? We're just going to get wrecked by the reinforcements. Okay, let's let's fight. We'll fight it swiftly. The silly reinforcements when they storm into the city will wreck us. But yeah, we'll turn around with our elephant army. Reclaim. In fact, yeah, we can slam into the... <laughs> Got a few of their forces here, can't we? They are weakened. We can still go into a lot of them. Take out their general early. All the elephants will already be void over here, won't they? And their cavalry. Ah, oh, they do have a ballista, yeah. Ready for orders. Actually be a lot of fun. Principes. Cross out there, please. Or can I actually get you in the gate post? In the gate itself. Rory here. Levies there. Let's go there. Principes sit there. They always they always send troops this way, don't they? Let's go and pop some of you there with you guys here as well. You'll sit in the centre. Cool. Right. Back over to my navy. Assault ships ready to attack. 
Uh, general, 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 general. I'll have you go after these spears. You guys just go forward against those missile ships. Assault ships ready for Assault order. Ships ready to attack. Go, go, go. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Yeah. Masili are uh, here. I'm this well. Hold. Our general is under attack. Crack em. Like a nut. Oh, I sent the general the other way. That's fine. Good, good. How many of them can we take out? The enemy general is dead. Yeah, he's dead. He's he's sunk to the bottom of the sea. Ready for orders. Ships ready for orders. Your orders. Hard on the orders. I catch some of these guys, although it's not dead on, so we may not get the uh, the killing blow. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Oh crap. Oh, that's fine. It's just all the all the missile units. The elephants are coming. It's fine. Stuff in the seas to deal with. The men are wavering. Ooh, damn. Come on, get one more ram in. Go, go, go. Assault ships reporting. Set on! Moving up, Commander! Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. That one's taken out. How are we doing? Proud Romans are waiting on us. Take them all out. Reform. Support ships ready. Assault ships. We've lost the, uh, the general. Fine. The enemy general is dead. Another one down. Good. No, maybe, maybe we can beat them all. I'll be, I will be pretty surprised if we can. Pretty cool if we do end up beating all of them. Nice. Right, that's all of their, all of the navy down. Only at the loss of one of ours. Land these guys over there. Here come the big boys. Some more elephants and stuff over there. The ballista. I'm gonna go out towards them actually with my levies. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Go! Getting busy. Their numbers might break us, but if we can flank around them. Take out that cav. By that cab. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. You take out those ballista. Form in here, then we'll hit them from multiple sides. Ow. Double time! Ready and waiting! We await your command! 
Push in. Take him out. Oh, really, they've got loads of artillery, haven't they? It's fine. Flank on round with these guys. Getting laggy. Spears. Let's bring these guys round as well. Go, go, go. One of our units has used all its ammunition. They just attack them because you don't do much damage with your missiles on them at all. Levies. Flank on round. Rory. Pull the levies back. Take out their archers. Nice. Keep taking out their artillery. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Charge their archers. Ready for orders. Actually, yeah, we, we might be able to win it. Definitely worth fighting it then. In this, well, yeah, it's definitely worth fighting in this case because we took out all of those guys, and we take out the Massili as well. In which case, elephant, sorry, you can turn around and keep going the other way. Elephant army. There's loads of missile troops now. I think we've got it quite safely. So we just need to break through their spears. Our hidden units have been discovered. Nearly killed this unit. Finish them off. I know they're firing into you. Are they dead yet? Yep, now they are. Last one. Has used all its ammunition. Orders. Ready. No the enemy. Oh god, I'm down 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 to three frames per second. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. About double time. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, let's, let's do that because I can actually move around still. Oh, are we going to be able to break all the spears? Hopefully. Hoping by giving an attack order on the one that is wavering. Breakthrough. They are shaken. We can keep the attack orders coming. Okay, just one unit of cavalry. That's all we would need right now. Oh, all, all we need this. That's when they all start going. Take them out of formation attack. If that helps. Fresh charges. Keep pushing. Triple speed it now. I just won't move the camera from here. Actually. Our men flee the field of battle. Still retain some control over it. We're losing some troops at the top, but they are losing more in their sort of shield walls. Go back to double. Oh. Oh, yeah, they've just all broken that. Yeah, here we go. Okay. 
<laughs> and to think I was this close Our men flee the field of battle. to not fighting this, this battle. I was so very, very close to not fighting it. <laughs> and just thinking, I'll just Our get the elephants in to do it. Of this is a shameful that worked out really well. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Come on, slay them all. There we go. Come on, push in. Last one. And then there's just three at the back. Jar pelting me. Or down to the last few shoot. It's gonna be it's gonna be close. Come on, break it. Go! Ah, oh, seriously gonna make me chase you. You annoying little buggers. No, thankfully we're slightly faster than you with some of them, I think. Go, go, go. There we go. Just these guys. Victory is mine! Woo! Pyrrhic victory. But, yeah, got the job done. Right, well, we will declare war next episode then at the start and uh, let everything unfold. The final great war begins. Part 43. This is where we'll wrap things up for now, so I hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter, Tech Prime on the Legion. Check out my affiliates and sponsors, Games Planet, Overclockers UK, QT, and MSI. Until the next one, ciao for now.